There's only eight days remaining to get this free bundle, free weapons, and free skins. The camo glitch still works. XP glitches are still popping off. Battle pass tokens so all day, every day by going AFK. Wait, is that number right? 300,000 XP for one game. Ladies and gentlemen, all the glitches currently working in Modern Warfare 2 right now are shown on screen with the timestamps for you to skip ahead and go to which one you want. These are all the best ones that are worth your time right now. But hold on, wait a minute. If you want to get your own custom bot lobbies in Modern Warfare 2, or unlock any camo in the game, even unreleased camos, or get blue prints from the store for a cheaper price or much much more then check out diamond services with almost 5,000 current customers in their discord thousands of reviews on their page you can see that diamond services are very reliable to work with for modern warfare 2 now if we can get 72 likes in this video that would be awesome and if you're new to the channel please subscribe i drop new glitches for modern warfare 2 every single day so it's worth your while trust me but the glitches yeah they don't last forever soon they'll be patched and we'll have to remember that's only until a new glitch is found maybe activision will focus and hackers now bitches get bitches in modern warfare 2 so as you can see, it's the 13th of September and the decoy XP glitch still works. All you have to do is go into Vondel on lockdown in quads, get your decoy ready, throw the decoy near enemies, and as you'll see, every single time they hear the decoy, you're going to get 500 XP uh, to your rank level. It's not going to give you weapon XP, but if you do this while playing a game like normal, you can get upwards of 30,000 XP on your weapon level and over 100,000 XP for your rank XP just by combining playing the game and throwing your decoys near enemies like I'm showing you right now. Super fun method. It's super easy and you can do this with all your teammates all at the same time and you just get XP for yourselves the more you do it throughout the game. And if you notice, you can see gold on my weapon. I don't even have gold unlocked on this gun. I don't even have this weapon leveled up to the max. So I think it's time to show you how to put gold on your weapon if you don't even have it unlocked or any other camo for that matter. Let's begin with a camo glitch. I load up my gun and I'm ready to go. I got a glitch in my pocket. It's a camo show. Okay, so gold looks pretty cool on the FA Advancer, but I don't have it unlocked and that's a bit of a problem. Platinum also looks cool. I don't have it unlocked and Polyatomic looks awesome, but I don't have it unlocked, unfortunately. But I'm going to show you how to unlock these camos, even if you don't have it unlocked for the gun that you want. All you need is another gun that has it unlocked. So for example, if I go to the M4A1, I have gold right here. Bang. I can put gold in M4A1. That means I can put gold in any single gun I want in the entire game. Let me show you how to do that right now. So go back to the gun that you want to put gold on. All you have to do is go to the save a custom mod and hold the PlayStation home button. And once you go back into Modern Warfare 2, you're going to press circle straight away. And now we're back to this screen. All you're going to do is go to the M4A1 behind the custom mod screen. So go down. And then from here, you're going to click the uh, weapon select. And then you're going to go to the M4A1. So find the M4A1 or any gun that you have unlocked with the camera that you want. And then we're going to go back up to Gunsmith. And then R1 for customize. And then go into camo. Uh, now from here, save it as what you want. I'm going to save it as lol because it's still funny that this glitch still works. And then from there, as soon as you change the camo, the gun's going to go back to the FA Advancer. And you can put any camo that you want. So I've got gold unlocked, right? But if I had platinum unlocked or polyatomic unlocked for this weapon, for the M4A1, I mean, then I could select those as well and put them on the weapon. But I only have gold unlocked for now. So I'm going to put on gold. I'm going to back out. And then bang, we now have gold. I'm in the game, it's Modern Warfare 2. I used to struggle, but now I'm feeling way brand new. I found a glitch, and let me tell you, man, it's given me superpowers. I'm Superman. I'm sticking up on it. I'm gonna be showing you how to get this weapon for free. But not only that, you're gonna be getting this skin for free and these double XP tokens as well. Okay, guys, so to get all this stuff for free in Modern Warfare 2, all you wanna do is go to google.com, search up Amazon Loot. Go to the Prime Gaming homepage. And if you haven't already, sign up for Amazon Prime Gaming. Or if you have an account already, then that's all good. Just sign in. Uh, you can sign up for a free trial as well. It'll still work on a free trial. Even if you cancel the free trial afterwards, you'll still have it in game. You're going to come down to recommended for you. Or if you don't see it here, just search up um, over here, Warzone. So I'll show you, for example, search up Warzone. There we go. It pops up. And you can just go here, get in-game content. Because it's linked with my Activision right now, I'm going to get it straight away. As soon as I click get in game content, it's going to give me a tick. There we go. Success. It's now in my account. And if I go to my PlayStation store and I go to my purchase, you'll see the pack there. And I'll show you that right now. So now when I go to the bottom right screen, you're going to go to my bundles. And then you're going to see right here, designated driver pack for Warzone. And then you'll see that I'll be able to unlock these bad boys right here. So I'm going to equip this to all my characters. And I'm going to be able to get this bad boy over here. Damn. This looks very, very nice. You can get it for free, as I said, by doing the steps I've just shown you. Let's see, let's see. Here we go. Glitches Get Bitches by Joey Rams. 
Wait, how in my glasses? There's some small text on the bottom. What does it say? Subscribe. I load up my gun and I'm ready to go. I got Boy, this is a big one. You can now get over 300,000 XP just for doing this glitch in Modern Warfare 2 DMZ and it's more simple than it looks. And the best part is anyone can do this because DMZ is free for everyone even if you haven't purchased Modern Warfare 2. So what I've done is I've found the two best videos on the internet right now that show you how to do this glitch. It's from Good Pecs at the Gamer and B-Man and they both go through it so thoroughly. You can literally choose either one and you're going to know how to do it straight away. But before you go and watch those videos, let me explain to you what the glitch is and then you can decide if you want to watch it or not. So you're going to land in DMZ and find one of these liquor bottles. You're going to go to the Koshi complex and then you're going to come to this buy station that is right next to the dead drop zone here. It only works in this location and getting here is a bit tricky but if you follow the guides of the links in the description you'll have no problem whatsoever. So once you get here you're going to drop the wine in the dead drop box and after you do this it's going to drop out a shopkeeper's code on the floor in front. If you have four of them you can sell them for 250,000 and then you can buy all these self revives and you can use them for XP and you can do this for an entire DMZ game and get so much weapon XP, rank XP, battle pass XP and XP's that you haven't even heard of, that's how insane this glitch is. So links are in the description, go choose if you want to watch them or not, but I thought I'd just let you know before it gets patched. My XP flowing, my weapon is glowing, I'm hiding under the map without you knowing, just so that I can level up fast, if I don't like how I play then kiss my ass. I'm going to be showing you the best weapon XP glitch to get for your weapons, which means that you can max out a gun in a single game or even half a game of plunder. And uh, just to show you what I mean, I got this much XP in just eight minutes of plunder. For some reason, the game ended super fast, but I can't control that. I'm just telling you how long it took to get this much XP and this many levels on my weapon. Okay, so this is very simple, but first you're going to need a partner to help you do this glitch, of course. And you're both going to load into a game of plunder. Now, the person that's going to be helping you get weapon XP is going to have the survivor perk and a uh, RPG equipped to his weapon class. And you're going to have the weapon that you want to level up and that's all you need now you're both going to drop at an ammo cache in plunder and your person that has a survivor perk and rpg is going to refill his ammo and then kill himself over and over again and you're going to revive him over and over again every single time you revive him you're going to get 200 xp but if you equip a weapon xp token and a battle pass xp token you're going to get 400 xp for your rank and 400 xp for your weapon xp every single time you uh, revive him and also make sure you have the weapon that you want to level up in your hand while you're reviving him the entire time and because he has a survivor perk equipped you're going to be able to revive him a lot faster than normal which means you get more xp per second and the game i did this in the game ended in about 10 minutes and i got 32,000 xp with a weapon xp token equipped and 26,000 xp for my rank as well i'm already tier 100 battle pass but if i'm not i would have got battle pass xp also so this is a three in one glitch and it's very good for weapon xp also as you've seen throughout the whole video i've just shown you so grab a buddy and go do this now that i'm always on top i'm the lord of these games i never fall behind i mean just let her tell you herself i'm one of a kind i love her plays i love her more Okay, so just a quick demonstration, no longer than 20 seconds. All you have to do is go to Resurgence Quads in Modern Warfare 2, make sure Squad Fill is on, go to Settings and put on Auto Parish to Deploy. You go to Controller, Advance and scroll up all the way to... Here it is, make sure that's on. Then you go back, you start a game and then done. That's it, go AFK. You can also go to sleep and this AFK will still work and you can wake up with tokens in the bank. I can't get enough, I want him every day. He's the best at the game in every single way. So in lockdown quads, if you stay to the end of the plane and go AFK to the bottom, you're going to get the shittest players you've ever seen in your life in Modern Warfare 2. They can't even shoot straight at you. And then if you go for a little walk around that area, you're going to see AFK players that you can just kill to get XP and weapon XP also. So that was a quick demonstration and yeah, have fun. Thank you very much for watching. Please drop a like and subscribe to see more glitches coming tomorrow and every single day after that.